All right, it's time to add the blend shapes. Let's go into setup mode here. We'll hide those blocks. We will click into the effects tab here, and there is a effect called Morph Blender. We'll highlight the face in the list. And we'll add this effect to the face. Let's go back to the items here. We'll rename this first cluster here to man underscore morphs. And we'll just add man to the end of Morph Blender there. If we move up here and highlight the morph target, you'll see that there's a cluster create block. Let's close up a couple of these blocks so we can see what's in here. Now we have a load cluster object delete clusters and the object here. Now we don't need to worry about this pull down menu. We're going to load all of our cluster slash objects from file. Now from the previous chapter, let's go into the objects folder. I have created several other model files that are exactly the same as my base mesh of the face here. But they're posed differently and I've named them in order of what they were posed in. For example, one of them has the eyes shut, so eye blinks. Hold down the control key. One of them has a f sound going on on their lips. An oo, a smile, a sneer, and one has an ah. So we're going to load all of those from the load cluster object. And you'll see that this jumble of wires here, they're actually separate models. If you look at the list, here are the models, but they've been converted to clusters, which means they are going to influence our face mesh. Now we don't need to see any of those, so hold down the shift key. We'll multi-select all of these. We'll change their draw modes to N. They'll still be there, just will be less clutter. So while we have our morphs selected here, we'll create a new slider, and it will make a slider for us. How to set up here. Get our list back. And under the cluster value, there's little pull-down menus. So we'll just start right at the top here. We'll make the top ah. Next one, eye blinks, f, ooh, smile, sneer. You can see if we move the slider, ah makes a nice sound, eye blinks, fuff, ooh, smile muscles here, and sneer. Now if we go into animate, you'll see that they don't work very well. Well, that's because our skeleton doesn't know it's supposed to be deforming. So we'll highlight this man deform node down at the bottom here. Make sure face is highlighted in the pull down menu. And there's a check mark box here called use predeformed points. So we'll highlight that. We'll also go into setup. Let's click into the effects tab here. And these effects execute from the top down. So right now it's using all of our animation bones to deform. And then it's applying Morph Blender. So we drag that to the top. So now our face deforms with Morph Blender. And then it is deformed with the bones. So now if we click into animate, we'll click on this long name called cluster slider. We'll see that now the morphs work. Let's go back into setup to the items, open up the rename block. Let's name this to something we can understand. We'll name this one face slider. We'll drag this down to our face controls because that's where it's going to be. So now, if we decide we want to make him smile, let's go into the Animate tab, and we'll move the corners of his mouth up, move the cheeks up, and we'll pitch the eyebrows up, highlight face slider, smile him some more, give him a bit of a sneer, and just make him look dopey. Hi. Let's go to the file menu here. I'm going to save this Messiah scene as face D dot FXS.